Well, hi there guys and gals. As you can see, another little RC conversion is about to start. This is little number 10 or 11, it depends whether you count my three mini littles. I've gone from biplanes to EDFs to singles to twins to even four engine mini ones, but this is the first one with twin fuselages. So, what am I going to do? Plan is small motor on each fuselage, same motor that I used on the little Spitfire here, which is a 2208. Lightweight construction, and this flies really well. I'm going to build it lightweight, no carbon, and bearing in mind that the only extra weight on it is one more fuselage, I think two of those small motors should be more than enough for this to fly. I'm going to have a problem with weight distribution, because if the battery's in one side, it's going to make it a bit heavy one side. But I'm thinking battery one side or maybe two small lipos, one each with a kind of joiner. Receiver and speed controller in one side. And it'd be great for FPV, especially if I can keep it light, because the FPV gear can go in this side. I'm going to leave the dihedral in. Just have to figure out what spacing it want, it needs. But it's going to be based pretty much on the width of the standard little tailplane. As I say, I'm going to leave the dihedral in, make it nice and easy to fly. So lightweight servo here, lightweight servo there. And I'm going to have to watch weight distribution to figure out whether I'm going to put an elevator servo in here or along here somewhere with a little cable to activate it. But looking forward to this, first step is going to be to figure, as I say, figure out the spacing, hollow these out, and if I'm brave enough, glue these in, and then ailerons right out here. Actually, I'm just thinking maybe I will have to take the bend out of the wing because if I don't, it's going to be a very small aileron because you can't put an aileron on a bend in a wing. Anyhow, just thought I'd share with you my ideas for my next little build, so watch this space. I'm not going to do a detailed build blog. Plenty of my build blogs up there for all of my things, the biplanes, the, the singles. The original build has got 55,000 views on it, I think. So they're up there. Check those out. And if you've got any ideas about the build of this one, particularly how I can deal with the weight distribution problem, please stick them in comments below. I'd appreciate that. But that's it for now. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you want to see how this one comes along. Or oh, don't forget actually to check out the channel and see some of the other flying stuff on it. But that's it for now. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you all later. Bye for now.